So why should you study abroad? Hello, my name is Abdullah Fawad. I'm a student studying in the University of Surrey here in the UK. And even though the world is pretty strange right now, many students are still deciding or at least thinking about where they want to study. So let's take a look at the top five reasons why to study abroad. Number five, exposure to a new culture. The simplest way to put it is like this. I tried to see what it's like to live outside the bubble I lived in before. I come from a tiny country, Bahrain. So getting this opportunity to learn from a wide range of cultures was really important to me. I am very happy I got to experience things like new food, new people, new lifestyles, and it ranged from how often we say sorry to how similar us university students behave, no matter where we came from. I also was lucky enough to take part of the football culture here in the UK, whether it's uh, seeing people's reactions to Premier League clubs or just playing with very tall European students. Um, exposure to a new culture is very, very important and one of the reasons I decided to study abroad. Number four, learning how to be independent. Before arriving in my accommodation for the first time, in the beginning of my first year in the university, I did not know how to cook, I did not know how to clean, and I did definitely did not know how to wash my clothes. I also did not know how to fix anything even a simple light bulb. <laughs> With that said, I wanted to try to live independently and test my adaptability. I think learning all these skills allowed me to grow so much more as a human and as a man. And it feels really nice seeing that I can do this adulting life. Number three, a top tier education. Wait, it's not number one. Yeah, it's not number one. Some countries, including the UK, are home to the one of the best universities in the world with international reputation and universal accreditation. Sometimes, the degree you wish to partake in is not available in your country. Sometimes, like many people I know, you are a super intelligent student with super high ambitions, super high goals who would like to test their skills among the best. Other times, uh, you are an average student who would like to prove themselves in a tougher environment, in a tougher educational environment. Even if I personally did not place the top tier education at number one, the quality of education is surely a big reason why to study abroad. Number two, career opportunities. This ties closely with number three, but as an international graduate, you will most probably have a significant edge when compared to other candidates when you're applying for a job. The unique experiences you have been exposed to and you have that you have under your belt will definitely make you more employable. And you might even find an internship part-time or full-time job in some big companies when you're in a country like the UK. But one thing is for sure, any career would be enhanced by this unique experience of studying abroad. And number one, do it if it makes you happy. Like many things in life, the decision whether or not to study abroad is an entirely personal and individual choice. For me, Studying in the UK gave me big, bigger targets, bigger ambitions, adventures I never thought I would go through, things and skills I learned that I never thought were possible, and amazing people I wouldn't have met otherwise. So the number one reason why to study abroad is 50% mixture of all the four previous points and 50% because you want to. So make a decision based on what you like, and your individual choice and what you want to do with your life because in the end that decision is up to you.